<laughs> it's down. It's down more than 200 points. Uh, joining us now for more. It's Craig Bolanos, the CEO of Wealth Management Group. Craig, thanks for joining us this yeah, morning. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, down a thousand points yeah. in two days. Wow. This is newsworthy items. If it, but we've had analysts on. They, they've been saying this for a long time that this is going to happen. <laughs> yes, and it, it took a long time. Overdue. Is this? Uh, what, what do you make of this? Is this? Is this a big fall or just a quick correction? Well, I, I think this is a big fall because no one's used to it. I, yeah. I mean, we've gone, you know, literally a hundred weeks without any volatility. So all of a sudden, you see headlines like Friday on the. Close down 666 to end on Friday, mm -hmm. that sits in people's minds. So I, I think realistically, America's waking up today and saying, what do I need to do to protect my nest egg? So what do people need to do? Well, I, I think the first thing is now is a great opportunity, if you haven't done so, to really take stock and just say, why are we investing? I mean, is it college? Is it retirement? And, and I'll use college as an example. If you've got a son or a daughter going away to school inside the next year, you probably don't want to have all of the money invested in equities, you want to have at least that freshman or sophomore year parked into some safe money strategies. Okay. Which, such as what most people would think that's bonds, but... Or a well, savings necessary. account? Just no, no, no. I want to go where Larry's going. That's right, because not all safe money strategies are created equal. And I think we're in a weird environment right now with the jobs market good, with inflation coming back, with a new Fed chair, Jerome Powell, that you just talked about being tested by fire. The enemy of bonds is rising interest rates. And what's happened? Yeah. Mortgage rates are the highest they've been since the fall of 14. So not necessarily bonds. Money markets, CDs, et cetera, might be the better alternative. Mm -hmm. What is it that... I mean, Obviously, we've been waiting for this correction to happen, but usually it's something in the news or something that triggers worry or panic in the markets. Was there something that triggered it on Friday? Well, there was. On Friday, we got a jobs report that everybody had to pinch themselves over. I mean, we expect. 180,000 non-farm payroll jobs, we get 200,000 jobs. And we saw wage growth, you know, the amount of money that people are getting paid up almost 3% year but that's over year. it's good news. It's great news, but when all of us have more money to spend, what do we do? We don't save it, we spend it. And when you have more money in the system chasing the same amount of goods, prices tend to go up. It's simple supply and demand. So now everyone's fearful that, you know, oh my heavens, are investors going to say, you know, with certain parts of the bond market paying just less than 3%, is that competitive for stocks? I say no, but it definitely caused a knee-jerk reaction. Mm. All right. Well, thanks, Craig. You can check out his website, Invest with WMG.